Dialectical behavior therapy or DBT is a therapy approach that believes that utilizing two dialectical or opposing forces uh, together at the same time can yield uh, far better outcomes than either one of them alone independently. In the case of DBT, those two concepts or forces are acceptance and change. And it takes the superficially paradoxical view that the more we learn to fully accept ourselves as we are, uh, the more capacity we have for making meaningful and important change. DBT is a time-tested process that has helped many, many people over a long period of time, including people who have struggled with very, very painful experiences, including recurrent suicidal thinking. So I want you to know that there is help available, um, that um, change can happen, and that you can get healthier, and DBT is one great way to potentially do this. DBT was created by a brilliant doctor named uh, Dr. Marsha Linehan. She developed the process over many years and it's based on the lessons that she learned from her own mental illness, as well as from working with many people over decades of her uh, clinical work. The four core concepts of DBT are um, emotion regulation, distress tolerance, mindfulness, and interpersonal skills. Uh, just a quick word on emotion regulation, something that I learned recently, which is really interesting, um, that often for people, it's not that the negative emotion is so intense that it is unbearable. It's rather that <clears throat> there is an intense fear or even a phobia about having the feeling in the first place. So for example, if someone has convinced themselves that they cannot uh, tolerate or survive uh, feelings of loneliness, they will do anything uh, to avoid this feeling. It's a survival impulse. And uh, often what they do can be very destructive and counterproductive uh, and create harm for themselves and for others. But, you know, we do what we feel we have to do to survive. But DBT can offer the lesson, the teaching that <clears throat> even very painful emotions and feelings are at the end of the day, just that, feelings. They're feelings that uh, will pass. Um, they're not pleasant, they're not fun, but they can be experienced and they can be tolerated. And with time, they can be uh, replaced with healthier uh, experiences. A full spectrum DBT protocol would include having an individual therapist who you see weekly, uh, participating in a DBT skills group and having a support network in place that you've created in advance of the participation. A DBT will likely to it, due to its nature, will bring up difficult and painful thoughts and feelings. And so these, this is the reason that a, um, a support network is important to, to have. And, um, you know, it's important to remember that nothing of great value in life can be achieved without hard work and time. And it turns out that um, changing negative and destructive thought and behavior patterns that have developed over a long period of time is just one of those great accomplishments that doesn't come overnight. Um, it can happen. And with hard work and a, a process, an organized process in place, it likely will happen. But um, it, does take, it does take effort and time. Uh, Boston Evening Therapy Associates 
is offering uh, a DBT skills group. Uh, you can learn more about this and you can register by visiting our website at bostoneveningtherapy.com. This group is open to anyone, anywhere who has the desire to make this change in their life and has a therapist and a support network in place. So I encourage you to, to take the step and I wish you the greatest of good luck and uh, encourage uh, your optimism and your courage and your belief that change is possible. I believe it is.